Good morning, and welcome to WBKS News. Today is Wednesday, October 5th, and it is a B1 day. I'm Aaron O'Brien. And I'm Tyler Davis. Juniors and seniors, the guidance department will be taking a trip to St. Bonaventure University on Friday, November 4th. We will leave BK at 2.30 and return at 11.30. The visit will include a tour of the campus, dinner at the Hickey Dining Hall, and tickets to the men's basketball game. This is a free trip for students to attend. If you're looking to apply to St. Bonaventure University, this is a great opportunity to see the campus. A sign-up sheet is available in the main office. You must sign up by October 17th to receive a permission slip. Attention Student Council, there will be a brief meeting today at First SAP in Ms. Hansen's room B129. This is a reminder from your Dean of Students, Mr. Miller. All students in grades 7 through 12 are to report to the cafeteria in the morning until the bell rings at 755. Students who are in the hallway are at risk of disciplinary action. Navy blue sweater, cell phone, and a pair of eyeglasses have been found. Please see Ms. Andrews to claim them or they will be donated. October is return a book for a treat month. If you have a book you either checked out or used from last year, you can return it to the library and get a treat in exchange. So look around at home or your car and return that book. Not only will your fine be forgiven, but you will also enjoy a tasty treat too. See Ms. Slifer with your return as soon as possible. There will be a freshman class officer meeting today during lunch to discuss homecoming. Please grab your lunch and meet in Mrs. Richardson's room, B127. Teachers, there will be a faculty meeting today at 3. Also, today there will be a bake sale during all three lunches to help support the peer ministers. I don't think you're ready for this, Carney. Get your game face on and prepare for October 12th because it is time to show your Carney spirit. We are going to kick off the week with Twin Tuesday and end our week with Theme Thursday and Carney Friday. Let's make this the best homecoming week yet. College visits today will be Ithaca College at 1030 and Nazareth College at 11. Tomorrow's colleges will be Wells College at 11, SUNY Canton at 12, and Canisius College at 1.30. We now turn to Do you have a heart for service? Do you like to work alongside your peers to improve our community? Are you needing a place where you belong? You're exactly what Bishop Kearney Key Club is looking for. Key Club is the largest student-run service organization in the country. The Kearney Key Club is accepting new members and renewing memberships until October 20th. All meetings are conveniently held during lunch and sat periods in room 116. Please bring your $12 dues to Mrs. Ship and join this exciting and life-changing organization in its effort to make a difference in this community. Remember, October 20th is a deadline. Hey there, all you trivia junkies. If you have a lot of trivia floating around in your head and enjoy playing Jeopardy, then joining the Kearney Masterminds team is definitely for you. If you're interested, please see Mrs. Grenier in room B114 as soon as possible. So you're good at trivia? I'm actually pretty good at trivia. See, I'm Key Club is more for me. Key Club? Yeah, yeah, service. Not so good with facts. Uh, I mean, I always used to watch Jeopardy with my mom. I was spitting out the answers. Alex Trebek couldn't keep up with me. Yeah. You're really cool. <laughs> we now turn to BK Sports. BK Sports, athletes get short, on the fields and on the court. Now we to report, BK Sports. Today at 5, four of your Bishop Carney varsity cheerleaders will be competing at Gates Chilite High School in the Eddie Meath All-Star Competition. Lexi Rivera, Jamie Fritz, Michaela Dennis, and Nora Battaglia Triggs. Good luck, girls. Open gym for boys basketball will be at 7 to 8.30 instead of 6 p.m. tonight. The girls' JV volleyball team defeated East on Monday, two games to one. Team captain Christy Reese had six aces and two kills. Julia Sullivan had three aces. Angelica Eshishmoa Esch had one ace and three kills. Maura Nicholson had three aces and two kills. And Lilia Rodriguez had three kills. Great job, girls. Next, the team plays home against Aquinas tomorrow, Thursday, October 6th at 4.30. Today's practices. Girls varsity volleyball at 3. And girls JV volleyball practice at 4.30. Today's games, JV football versus Wayland Cohocton at BK at 6, and that will do it for sports. So uh, how about this volleyball team? A lot Vol of announcements. Yeah, the JV volleyball team is great. I also want to give a shout out to Lexi Rivera right behind the camera. Good, Thanks, good luck. looking at you, kid. Thanks. Yep. All right, that'll do it to WBKS News. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, I'm Erin O'Brien. And I'm Tyler Davis. Have a good day.